Hello, welcome to Martin Maths, We're doing the Foundation Maths GCC paper, paper one from November 2023. This is question 24. So Mano has three shelves of books. There are X books on shelf A, there are 3X plus one on shelf B, and there are 2X minus five books on shelf C. The total is 44 books on the three shelves. All books have the same mass, and the books on shelf B have a total mass of 7,500 grams. So that's 7,500 grams. So we've got to work out the total mass of the books on shelf A, i.e. we've got to work out what X is in number of books and then uh, work out what that is. So let's add up what we know. We know that the total number of books is 44, which is all the books of A plus B plus C. So 44 is equal to X plus 3X plus 1 plus 2x minus 5. So 44 is equal to, collect the like terms, 5, 6x minus 4. Add that 4 to that side, 48 equals 6x. So x will equal 8. And that is uh, what x is in terms of books. So there, A has 8 books. B has now 3 times 8 plus 1, 25, and C has 2 times 8 minus 5, which is 11. So now I know, and I can check that, does 8 plus 25 is 33, 44, so I know that adds up to 44. I've got the number of books, but I need to find the total mass, okay? So what I've been told is that B is 7,500. So I now have another piece of information that 25 books equal 7,500 grams. So I need to work out how many, uh, lots of 25 are in that. So I need to divide 7,500 by 25. I know that 25 goes into 75 three times. So I know then that one book is 300 grams. Still not the end of the question, because I now need to combine those two pieces of information. Um, I firstly found a piece of information with the number of books, and then a piece of information about the weight of the books, and now I need to combine the weight of the books in A. So if the A has eight books, and each book is 300 grams, I need to eight times 300 grams, 2,400 grams in shelf A. Okay, it's a five mark question. So there's lots of steps you need to uh, earn your marks there. One for noticing that the total books is A plus B plus C, then collecting those terms to make this equation and solving it to find out the number of books. Uh, you don't have to find the books on each shelf, but I did just to check. Um, you had to find out the books on B, so you could connect that to the mass information they gave us there. And then you find out the mass of one book. And then finally, multiplying that up to work out the total mass of the books on shelf A. And that's a nice five mark problem solving question. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share. And good luck with your maths.